Hey everybody, here we are again. First weekend in May, and we're out for another dog walk around the Entwistle area. We're just coming past Wayall Reservoir now, and it's absolutely cracking the flags. Fantastic. Don't know what the temperature is, but it's warm. It's uh, no need for any sort of layer other than shorts and t-shirt, or a vest, as the case may be. This is the, I'll show you the view of Wayall Reservoir in a second, I'll just get past this tree. Right, that's the reservoir, the one lower down from Entwistle Reservoir, and the feeder, not really a stream, I don't know what you call it, um, comes from the other reservoir anyway, a bit like a feeder stream, but it's man-made, joins the two reservoirs up. So we've been geocaching, found another of the Entwistle round, exploring Entwistle caches, can't remember what it was called, hanging around or something like that. I'll, uh, I'll put it in a caption because I can't think. Just a quick one. Uh, I'm planning on doing probably another all grain courage best bitter this weekend. That's if we get round to it. I'm also planning on upgrading the tap on the Burko boiler because the outlet's very Heath Robinson. And one of these days we're going to have hot water spilling everywhere, which we definitely don't want. Two reasons it hot, it's hot and it burns, and if it's spilling everywhere, it's not going to get brewed. Got to wait for the other dog. Bell's here as usual. I'm going to say hello, Bell. Put the hello to the camera. Oh, she's saying hello to me fist. That's easy. Bringing up the rear slowly. Both doing steam train impressions. Right, this is the causeway between Rayo Reservoir. And I think it's the input from Entwistle. It does lead from Entwistle, I'll just show you that. Some, uh, there's a nice aqueduct. There's the aqueduct. And there's Way Over Reservoir again. Right, I think that'll do, just a short one. So anyway, we'll get back when there's the brew day happening. I'm gonna adjust the recipe again slightly. Not again. Slightly. I did the old grain last time, it was the courage best. And it doesn't taste anything like Courage Best Bitter to be honest. The, uh, there's too many dark multi flavours in it. Courage Best Bitter is, is lighter. Right, enough waffling. Cheers. See you later. Bye.